steakhouse, dry aged meat is all the rage, right? I mean, right. everyone's into it. It's delicious. It takes months to age. And if you go to a steakhouse, it's fifty plus dollars for that steak. But I'm going to show you. For one piece of steak, that's just the steak. Just for the steak. This but, trick is so clever. I love it. So we're going to get the flavor of dried steak. When people eat dried steak, they say, oh, it, it's got this funk to it. It smells like old red wine or blue cheese. So why not wrap the steak itself in some blue cheese? So what we're going to do Give me a high five. Yeah, right. And, and this cut of steak. Yeah. This okay. cut of steak, yes. how, much, how much money was this? Wow, not expensive. This is flat iron. So, I mean, it's not a ribeye or a strip or a filet, so it's not expensive. So this could be, um, it could be skirt steak or it could be a flank steak, but this is flat iron. It's from the Chuck. But flat iron sounds it's expensive, delicious. doesn't it? And for two people, under 15 bucks. Under so 15. So from 50 to 15. All right. So, you know, we don't have to age it in a cave, obviously. We're gonna just wrap it overnight. So I have some cheesecloth here, and we're gonna wrap up our steak, and then it's pretty simple. We're gonna take some blue cheese, and this could be any blue cheese. It doesn't have to be expensive Doesn't have to be cheese. super expensive. And what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna really just kinda coat it in all of this blue cheese, right? Beautiful. We're gonna coat it, and you kinda get the picture there. And then real simple, we just tie it up. Tie right? it off. So simple to do. We let this sit overnight. If you got an extra day, it could sit for two days. And what we have- What do you guys do for a date night, you and your beautiful wife? Because yeah. for you, you've got your own restaurants, you cook all the time. What's a date night for you? I can tell you what we don't do is go to my own restaurants because <laughs> yeah. it's like going to work for your date night, so it doesn't yeah. work out. I'm always thinking about the food. But we have two little girls, so kind of anything without the kids. Right. Like some quiet time is pretty good, but I love like just jumping on an airplane, going snowboarding or something like that, yeah. which is a pretty nice date, and I think. And you know, people forget on date night, you don't have to have a babysitter and stay in. You can stay in and make dinner because believe me, there's nothing sexier than somebody who cooks for dinner. You're always going to be dessert, even if you burn dinner. It's going to work out this much is better. True. This but is true. You can hire, you can hire babysitters to take your children, or like I do, my dog, out of your house. They can take them on excursions, and you can have date night and stay in. That is a great idea. In your own house. Thank you so much. That is an inspiring idea that Any I'm going to have to do that. Any little thing I can do for you, Top that. Chef. <laughs> All right. So here's what we have. This is the steak that sat overnight. Look at this, overnight, guys. Look right? at that. Look at that, how, how all that flavor is permeated right into the meat. And look, you just cut away that cheesecloth. Cut away the cheesecloth, and then we're just going to really simply unwrap this meat. All right, and you can just smell like the funk. Now the beef has sort of married in there. Oh my god, it's going to all go. taste like blue cheese. And then you can take that blue cheese, you can make a sauce out of it. And what's yeah. left is this piece of meat that's just sort of been aged, right? Mm. And it's got that funk to it. Here's a piece over here. That's all set so to I'm go gonna in start, the pan. I'm going to start cooking that. Okay. So you grab that towel real quick. Sure, babe. So hot pan, and you can kind of see like like aged meat has that sort of dry, like almost it's has not that look it's too. not blood red, but it's got this maroon sort of thing going on. Right. And you can see that that looks like it's been aged, but it's really only been aged overnight. So it's already got so much flavor, this. you can really smell it. Just mm. uh, a little salt and pepper. That's all you need for good food, right? That's you don't need a ton of spices. Less is more. Salt and pepper. Delicious. Really, really hot pan. We're going to throw that in there. That's mm. the sound you want to hear. And then I'm going to do what happens. And you can do this at home, but this is what happens in that fancy restaurant is I'm going to baste this meat. I'm going to throw in a little bit of whole butter in there. Mm. I'm going to throw in a couple of garlic cloves and Yum. a couple of thyme. And this is going to spit a little bit right here. It's gonna pop. Yum. And then I'm just gonna, I'm gonna flip this meat and I'm gonna baste it. And this is what's happening when you spend $65, $70 in a steakhouse. This is what's happening. All right, they're taking care of that Look meat. Look at that color. Look how brown that is. Look how crispy. And then oh. real simple, I'm just gonna take some, take some of those but, that butter and just really just sort of oh, baste killing. that meat. All right, so there we go. So I think this steak's pretty thin. I think He's we, beautiful. This, 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 we could eat this mid-rare or rare. So I'm going to let it just finish up here for maybe one more second, and he, then we're going to let it rest. Yeah, I think, crank I think we'll, it down if you want. There we go. We'll yeah, turn it down, good. and let's see. Well, yeah, I think, I think it's good to go. How do you like your I steak? I think it's beautiful, rare. Yeah. All right, rare is good. We'll, we'll, we'll bring it over here. We'll let it rest. Get some of those herbs and that garlic right oh on top god, of that, that steak. Oh my god, that smells amazing. And that's a, a big tip is you want that meat to rest, right? So all those juices are inside of the meat. They're going to stay in there.